Welcome back to this special edition of NCBA's Cattlemen to Cattlemen as we get insights into the work of Purina on behalf of animal nutrition and the beef cattle industry. Dr. Scott, I wanted to get back to you. Tell us what you've learned in terms of getting cattle off to a great start. Well, it's more than just one thing. And it actually all starts off back at the cow herd. Hmm. Because for a calf to perform after weaning, it had to have proper nutrition from mama to begin with, which is a combination of protein, energy, vitamins, and minerals, mm -hmm. and the whole sustained nutrition that we talked about. But after weaning is when we have more people issues that come in, mm -hmm. right? So it takes very good planning. Uh, you have to match your labor resources. Uh, so for example, if you have forage and you want to use your forage, mm -hmm. then you're gonna have a, a different type of product. You'll need to buy something to go along with it. Mm -hmm. Some people may not have any forage resources, either they don't have any or they've got a drought. Maybe they need a complete diet. Mm -hmm. uh, and so th those types of thought processes are very important mm -hmm. to go through with your, your feed supplier. But the other thing that is even more crucial is what are you gonna do relative to your pens? Mm -hmm. So how big is your pen? So ideally, a, the perfect square footage is around 450 50 square foot per head as max. Mm -hmm. uh, if you wean your calves in a uh, one section trap, they're not gonna see very much of the feed bunk mm -hmm. because they're gonna be out walking. Mm -hmm. And the thing to remember, the bigger the pen size is, the more walking cattle do, mm -hmm. and they will walk off their weight gain. Mm -hmm. Well, the weight gain's worth a lot of money today. Mm -hmm. And so we want them to gain as much weight as we can. But it's so important to get them to eat so having the bunks in the right place mm -hmm. uh, in the pen is important. So you don't want them in the center of the pen. Mm -hmm. We want the bunk to be perpendicular to the fence line because mm -hmm. after weaning, the calves ball, they walk the fence line, mm -hmm. and they'll run into the bunk. If they mm -hmm. run into the bunk, they've got a better chance of eating. Mm -hmm. But you've got to have something palatable to eat, and that's where we come in with, sure. with our products. So, you know, we talk a lot about intake modifying technology, and people think, oh, intake limiters. We do other things too. Mm -hmm. We want cattle to eat more. And so we do a lot of research too of knowing what ingredients and the nutrients encourage consumption in calves. And if they eat the right amount of feed, they've got a better chance of fighting off disease on their own. Mm -hmm. So that's kind of what it's all about with great starts. Yeah, that's a great, great point. And uh, I understand uh, that you do have a number of different possibilities depending on your management system and your goals. Uh, Dr. Ficaro, maybe tell us a little bit more about what some of the options are. Well, Kevin, I think to introduce these options, let's let Mark Sullivan, one of our customers, really kind of tell us what our options are, sure. and we'll start that discussion after that. Okay. A lot of the cattle that we're going to, uh, that are coming to our operation, uh, have had nothing but mama's milk and green grass and pond water. It's very important to uh, get them hydrated and get some feed in them. We want to get them settled and, and comfortable just as quickly as possible. And good feed is, is uh, probably the number one uh, part of that. We have been Purina customers for quite some time. Uh, we, we used uh, the impact starter um, on some cattle. We've used the Precon 5. Uh, we've had good success with all of them uh, in, in different capacities. But um, it's a good feed. Uh, it's, uh, it's well put together. It's um, um, consistent. I don't want to mix a lot of feeds. Um, frees up uh, time and manpower and uh, helps us concentrate more on what we think we do better and that is uh, looking after stock calves. Dr. Ficaro, maybe uh, give us just a little bit more insight into some of the options with Great Starts. Well, and the key is one, we don't have one size fits all and there are options out there and I think uh, Mark Sullivan that we just heard from kind of alluded to it that uh, he wants a feeding program that allows him to not worry about the feed so he can take care of his stock calves. Mm -hmm. And that's kind of what he said, that's what he wants. Mm -hmm. So we've got those options. Uh, the really the first question, like when Bob goes out and tries to position our starters, does that rancher want to use homegrown forages? Right. And if he does, and that wants to be the majority of the, what that animal is going to consume, we're going to recommend our pre five product. That's a five pound supplement to get those animals a protein, energy, vitamins and minerals, trace mineral fortification with available four organic uh, trace minerals from Zenpro, uh, some Diamond V yeast in that to get the rumen fermentation going so they can use that grass. Because mm. that's the key, they want to utilize, utilize the grass. Mm -hmm. So that's one option. 
Let's say, like Ron said earlier, a time of drought. There's no forages out there. You've got to have a complete feed. Mm -hmm. So maybe your objective is get those calves going and get them on feed very rapidly to go to the next stage of production. You may only want to feed a starter seven days, 10 days. And that's where our pre-con complete product really comes in. It's a free, it's a complete feed, uh, based on all the nutrition's in what they're getting in, in that pellet. And a very palatable, one of our most palatable feeds that we make to get that intake in very, very rapidly. Mm -hmm. Then finally, uh, there's another option that maybe you want to save on labor. You want to save, uh, do some uh, free choice feeding. You want to optimize performance, get the best gain, the best efficiency. We want to utilize our intake modifying technology, and that's where our Accuration Starter Complete line comes in. So we've got those different options out there. It just depends on what uh, uh, understanding what the options are, that the, the needs that the customer has. Sure. And it seems there are some good Purina customers that agree with your view. The Satisfied Great Starts Cattle Program believers tell of their personal experience for stocker operations in Tennessee, for Precon 5, and available for tubs. Upon receiving of these cattle, the first 24 to 48 hours, I think, dictates the kind of luck you usually have with the next 30 days. The quicker we can get them started on, on either hay or food and get the room into working, the, the better the vaccination programs work and the less sick cattle we have. Now, these little calves are walking, and they're in two to three acre traps and we're weaning them. They're going through a stress period and they walk and they'll take a bite and they'll walk. And it don't take a lot of the pre-con five, I think five, five pounds to five, you know, one percent of their body weight and they've gotten enough in them to, to help them out. We've done a test on the pre-con five and we've used pre-con in the past and the results were, were kind of what I thought they would be. They really wasn't surprising. They were, they were good results. Uh, the cattle started on it quicker, and we had eight pulls, I think, out of 98 head, but none of them went to the sick lot. They all went just to one treatment deal for a four-day treatment and right back out in the pasture, right back the same day, right back on the bunks. And getting these cattle started the quicker, I, I know for a fact that the quicker they get started, the, the better luck you'll have the next 30 days. If you can't get a group of cattle to start, you're going to have some long days in the next six weeks, pretty regular. The Avela 4 tubs we started using pretty re religiously probably a year and a half ago. And I could see it wasn't something you saw quick. It was over a period of time, but, but our selling weights 150 days down the road our selling weights went up and I could see that our sick lots was, was less than our pulls were less. And I think a lot of that is due to the Vela 4. I mean, I know there's other factors that have to figure into those things, but I'm still feeding the Vela 4s and I believe they helped our operation. They get off to a better start. The less sick, the, the, the sooner they go to gaining weight, the, the better your health program will work. <laughs> I hate to say this, because it'll happen to me, it'll come back and bite me, but We've actually had weeds grow up in our sick lot the last, last year. And Great Starts also works for feedlot operations in Nebraska. The thing I feel that's probably the most important to get cattle off on the right foot is, is nutrition. And if we can get those cattle to eat and get them healthy, uh, make sure that they have the right uh, nutrients to make things work. And so what we're doing is using some uh, Purina uh, Precon 5 and along with the uh, wind and rain tubs with a veil of four in them, I think the combination of those two fits the bill of what we're trying to do. Uh, get the calves uh, on the right foot, head in the right direction, because with where we're at anymore in this industry, we know that, that uh, uh, pounds pays the bill. And when we have high feed cost, everything has to happen just perfect. Great Starts is also working for wean calves in Nebraska. With this program, it seems like we've had a lot less uh, health issues. Um, they go on to feed quicker, and therefore it turns into a better rate of gain for us in the first 45 days. The pre-con gets them in the feeders, gets them curious, and generally we'll just come now before the, the pre-con is completely gone and put the accuration right on top of it so that it filters down through the pre-con pellets and, and uh, keeps them right in their eating. Healthy calves will gain well. The better health your calves are in, the better they will gain. I think it all starts with less stress, getting them on feed quickly, and getting consistent feed in all the calves. Well, Bob, tell us about how you use the Great Starts program up in our country. Well, we use it, we just try and match the product to the customer. You know, these guys have developed the good products, whether it's complete or with a five pound pre-con five. Uh, you know, we just try and match what it takes to 
get that gain on that calf, get a healthy calf, calf right now, and at the dollars these calves are, it's healthy, wealthy, and and keep them keep yeah, them growing. Absolutely. Well, thank you very much, and thank you all for your comments. Now, to find out more about this and other topics related to cattle nutrition and Purina, visit the website cattle.purinamills.com.